In this video, we're going to take a look at how you can pair a PlayStation DualShock 4 wireless controller to an Apple TV. We will then demonstrate how you can unpair the DualShock controller from your Apple TV and pair it back to your PlayStation 4. In order to use a games console's wireless controller with an Apple TV, you will need to ensure that your Apple TV is using tvOS version 13 or above. Now from the home screen, if we locate and select settings, from within settings, we will find an option called remotes and devices. When we select this option, we need to locate and choose Bluetooth. Under Bluetooth, we have an option called how to pair games controllers. This option simply informs us how we can place our controller into discovery mode. As you can see, we have instructions for both a PlayStation and Xbox wireless controller. So let's follow the instructions for a PlayStation DualShock 4 controller. If on our controller we press and hold down both the PS and share buttons for roughly 5 seconds, the light bar on the front of the controller will start to flash. This signifies that the controller is in discovery mode. If we return to our Apple TV and select OK, under the option Other Devices, our DualShock controller will be listed. Let's highlight and select our controller. As you can see, after a brief delay, our controller will be automatically connected to our Apple TV. Let's return to the home screen and try and play a game. As long as a game has been programmed to work with a game's controller, we should be able to use our PS4 controller to play any game. In order to once again pair our DualShock controller with our PlayStation 4, we will need to remove the pairing from the Apple TV. However, if the battery in your DualShock controller has been fully depleted, before you try and pair your PlayStation 4 to your controller, you need to make sure that the controller has been fully charged. Now from the home screen of our Apple TV, if we return to settings and once again select remotes and devices, by selecting Bluetooth, we will see our DualShock 4 controller. If we select our controller from the list under My Devices, we will be presented with two options that allow us to manage our controller. Let's select Unpair Device. We are now asked to confirm that we wish to unpair our controller from our Apple TV. When we select Unpair Device, the Apple TV will lose its connection to our controller. In order to pair our controller back to a PlayStation 4, we first need to power on the game's console. While the console is booting, we once again need to place our controller into discovery mode. With our PlayStation 4 now displaying the Welcome Back to PlayStation screen, and our DualShock controller in discovery mode, we simply need to connect the controller to our PlayStation 4 via a USB lead and press the PS button on our controller. The light bar on our controller will then change to a solid colour to signify that the controller and our console have been paired. We can now disconnect the USB lead from our controller and control our console wirelessly.